We will be looking at some very important language now, some very essential vocabulary involving circles. And we need to be aware of these words in order uh, to be able to work with circles. Yeah? So check my site, explainingmaths.com, where you can find all my resources nicely organized. Now, circles, um, as you can see, I have put a little dot there, and that dot is the center of the circle. Now, that, that is already important uh, to appreciate, yeah? that that is the center. And if from the center, yeah, if from the center we draw a line to the circumference of the circle, so for instance that line, then we call that line the radius. So let me just move it a little bit. I have a lot of colors now. Uh, that is the radius. Okay. If we draw a line from one side of the circumference to the other side of the circumference, and that line goes through the center of the circle, then we have a radius and another radius, and then that entire line we call the diameter, okay? So that is the diameter, which is two times a radius, okay? Well, I think so far you were already familiar with the essential keywords, yeah? But what do we call a line from one side of the circumference to the other? Let me just sketch that, which does not go through the center of the uh, of the circle, yeah? And that is also important to know, we call that a chord, okay? That is a chord, yeah? So that is a line from the circumference to, uh, let me do it here, to the circumference, but it's not going through the center, that's why it is not a uh, diameter. Okay, very good. If I look at a radius and another radius, then the area those two lines enclose, yeah, so that area, do I have a different color? I have some green here, look at that. So if I look at this area, we call that a sector, okay, that is a sector. So that is a, a piece of the pie if you like, yeah, but then we have a radius and a radius and the circumference, that is a sector, the area, okay. Um, if we look at a part of the circumference, so for instance, this part of the circumference, yeah, how do we call that? We call that an arc, okay? So a sector is that part of the area, the arc is that part of the circumference. One last word you need to be familiar with, the area of this part, Okay, so that is not enclosed by two radii, it's just enclosed by a chord and the circumference. We call that a segment of the circle. Okay, so that is different than a sector. Arc is a length, sector is an area, segment is an area, but it doesn't have two radii yeah, to enclose it and the circumference, no, it's just a chord. We're talking about the center of a circle, a radius, and two radii will make a diameter, yeah? Two radii in a straight line, that is. Okay, so that was the language um, which you need to know when it comes to circles, okay? So make sure you have seen all my videos about different types of angles, triangles, quadrilaterals, polygons, yeah? Now circles. Um, and like and share this if it was useful so I can help your friends too. And go to my site explainingmaps.com where you'll find all my resources nicely organized and they're there for you uh, to use. So I'll see you later. Bye bye.